Hi everybody, we're gonna do a Q&A. We're gonna talk about how to style this particular jacket. So this jacket is in the Armory's Spring Summer Collection. It is a pale blue wool mohair hop sack, and it's a lovely color. It's a little bit unusual, and I figured, well, it's probably not something that people are so used to styling, so let's put together some options and show you what works, and in fact, also show you what might not work. Okay, let's start with this. This is real easy, just a white cotton shirt, pair of cocky trousers. This one's in wool, but certainly you could use like chinos instead. And then a pair of brown loafers. Very easy, right? In fact, what's interesting about this particular one, and one of the reasons why I liked this one with this particular jacket is this is our holiday shirt. So this is the one that we do with a one piece collar. And it's got this great shape up here. Like it looks good without a tie and it tucks itself very neatly and creates this really nice arc once you have the jacket on. So that's one option for how to style this but I mean, I'm sure you guys already knew this one. Let's look at some other things, right? So uh, let's have a look at this. We've got pale gray striped shirt with bone colored chinos, right? With this, sort of co with this sort of pale blue, we have to really create a little bit of extra contrast. Um, and there's enough separation here between this cream and this baby blue and also with the gray stripe and the baby blue as well. In terms of accessories, um, actually, this would be a great opportunity to use something a little bit brighter. So this is from Sevenfold this season. And this burnt orange, surprisingly, like really brings the outfit to life. Like rather than having the whole thing be a little too washed out and muted, this kind of adds a bit of fun to the whole thing. In terms of pocket squares, um, I would stay within the same color range as well. So Drake's has this beautiful one this season that is, if I can even remember the composition, I apologize, cotton silk. <laughs> cotton silk with a green trim for a little bit of extra visual interest. And then shoe wise, what we're talking about is uh, buh, 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 this snuff suede. This is the Armory's Wyndham in snuff suede. There you go, that's one way to put this thing together. Now let's have a look at another option. Bear with me for one second. What if we wanted to use slightly more saturated colors, slightly darker colors, yeah? Um, certainly could do that. So let's try this. So this is our dark khaki um, wool cotton mix trouser. In terms of like yellowish shades, um, I think this is probably about as dark as I would go. Uh, I'll show you an option of what really I think doesn't work with this jacket. Um, so this is about as dark as I would go for the trouser and for a yellowish shade. Um, let's lighten it a little bit more by using just a plain white shirt like that. And then for accessories, uh, I think since we're already using darker colors, we wanna put together something that's a little bit more dressy, a little bit more somber. So navy pattern tie, again, another piece from Sevenfold. And then this is a good chance to like, since this thing's so somber, right? This is a good chance to say to yourself, well, maybe we have something that's just like fun and unusual in there, right? Like, so this blue pocket square from Drake's, I think is like the easy, sensible match, of course. But actually, I think this teal turquoise is much more interesting like sort of unexpected, but actually sits really well with that palette. And then in terms of footwear, I'll go with this, our brown suede Broadway loafer. This was actually what I was wearing with this particular white shirt cocky outfit that I had on just now as well. Okay, so another nice setup. Now, you know, I was hinting at like, oh, what are the colors they shouldn't wear with this stuff? And um, it's funny, like we often don't talk about the things we shouldn't really wear. Uh, but my producer, Sam, brought it up and I thought it was a great idea. So let's have a look at something that I think really doesn't work. To me, this doesn't work. <laughs> Dark brown chocolate corduroy. And I mean, you, the minute you look at it, you're just like, oh, that's a bit off somehow, right? And if you try to define why it's off, I think that's a useful exercise. It's a little bit off because firstly, like, Texturally, it doesn't quite make sense, right? Like, why do you have this heavy-ish corduroy sitting with this clearly very lightweight summerish fabric? 
Secondly, like this dark, dark brown just feels a little funny against this very light, pale blue. You know, you've got the, almost the wrong sort of contrast going on here. Um, let's look at some other shirts that really are not going to work with this. Um, I've got two here that on their own, these are great shirts, right? It's just in this combination they don't work so well. I've got this like dark green stripe, dark green butcher stripe, which actually looks great with the brown cords, but it looks really goofy with this shirt. You know, because the green stripes and the blue of the jacket, just there's no separation, there's no contrast. Like it doesn't feel comfortable to look at. Let's substitute in even this, right? Like a dark green against this pale blue, also kind of awkward. All right, that's enough, that's enough do nots for now, enough, ne enough negativity for now. Um, let's go back to stuff that does work very well. Blue jeans. You know, one of the reasons why I really like this particular baby blue jacket is because of how well it suits dark denim like that. Such a lovely contrast, so coherent. <laughs> and then in terms of shirts, um, this one's pushing it a little bit. I like it, but I can see the argument for maybe not wearing it. This is a kind of ecru with a light brown check. Now, I really like not using a stark white with this. You know, I like that the colors are a little bit more subtle with this ecru and with the check. But I have to say like the check maybe is a little bit tight in relation to the hop sack texture here. So, you know, it kind of depends on the wear. Personally, I don't mind it and I think it looks really good with the jeans. I think also you could imagine this either just open neck, um, it is a button down collar after all, uh, or with a knit tie. I think it would look really good with a knit tie. And as for shoe wear, um, these just came into the store. These are the Moonstar uh, sneakers, just plain white canvas. And there you go. Also, if you wanted some alternatives to this, um, the ever faithful polo is always available. So blue jeans, white polo, baby blue jacket. And then the canvas sneakers, or you could even reverse it. You could do navy polo like that, and then white jeans like that. Another good look. And then just reversing that palette. Alrighty, um, I hope you guys have, will consider this jacket. Um, it is actually really one of my favorites in the collection this year. I think it's really, really an unusual color. Um, it's also a very unusual weave and texture, uh, surprisingly versatile. If you guys have any other ideas for how outfits might come together, please feel free to leave a comment. We would love to hear from you. And that's it for now. Styling the Armory's baby blue wool mohair mixed jacket. Thanks for watching.